Today marks a historic event for the Afghan National Army as they demonstrate their combined military capabilities. This exercise is the first to demonstrate the results of four and a half years that NATO training mission Afghanistan and ANA have been training together. We've been heavily engaged with them at the Armour Branch School with the Mobile Strike Force um, introduction of it as an equipment uh, where we've provided training advisory teams and uh, direct assistance with those capabilities and the same with the infantry as well. Um, Commander Surge has been working closely and we saw some of the equipment provided by NATO uh, and some of the training as well um, in the displays that we saw today uh, and particularly the counter IED stuff which has been um, a CJ3 NTMA led uh, initiative and we saw a full display of that both in the static stands and the mobile display as well. This exercise has played a key role for the future of Afghan National Army. As we have shown to our enemies that our Afghan National Army is capable to defend independently from our country, our nation, under any circumstances. The event, which was coordinated within a week, included mobile strike force capabilities, special forces, air assault, counter IED, along with medical and resupply logistics. I think we just need to try and widen the, the sphere of knowledge um, across the cores so they're comfortable with, with this level of integration that we're seeing here today. But no, I think this is enormously positive. I think any army from the international community to lay on a demonstration like this, both in terms of the static and the range of the equipment, but also integrating that into a, a scenario like we saw, is, you know, this is a real demonstration of their professionalization. While this demonstration proves a victory for the ANA, the ability for this level of training to reach the full capacity of the military still lies ahead. From NATO training mission in Kabul, Afghanistan, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Michael Cowley.